Hi all folks, this is Max from GalaxyS3Root.com. So what would you do if the world ended tomorrow and you have to pick one person to root and install custom ROMs on your phone? Anyway, um, just stupid thing I'm going to try to add. Uh, I've got the Galaxy S3 ROM review of the Foxhound. Um, Foxhound has been known to have um, really cool uh, performance. So this one does come with uh, performance enhancements. Um, what I like about the um, Foxhound is that they've actually built the performance um, basically set CPU into their settings menus, no other separate apps because those things can um, drain your battery but um, this is built in. Um, so I got it set to um, let's set it to 1.704 gigahertz that's four cores baby um, and uh, you can you, you can even mess with the voltage control um, you can do it my my phone started rebooting at 18 uh, 1.8 gigahertz so you can play with those numbers maybe bring it down to 1425 or bring it up just a little bit 1460 and see if you can get a consistent um, 1.8 gigahertz out of it but without doing anything I can get 1.7 gigahertz just fine and uh, this ROM is comes with you have the option to install the TouchWiz or the Apex launcher my uh, recommendation is uh, it ha actually comes with graphical installer when you do it install the TouchWiz and then um, you can install Apex or Nova launcher off the market um, that way you can have all of the launchers that's what I realized while, while I was doing this um, but pretty good. Foxhound it used to be called Batista when Galaxy S2 first came out, and it was one of the fastest ROMs ever. Um, it's you know it's really for people performance minded. Uh, makes your phone pretty darn fast. I've been seeing a uh, very smooth, uh, everything very smooth on this ROM compared to other ROMs, and also uh, sort of de bloat it. Um, you're gonna just find the apps you absolutely need. So let's run Quadrant and see how fast this thing can go. Um, last time I got almost, last night I got almost 6,500. Um, I like it. It's a, it's a good ROM. It also comes with Sia kernel. Um, and uh, Foxhound al always has been focused on performance, and I like it. it they have very simple ROM. Um, you know, always with an overclockable kernel. And uh, this is actually the first ROM that actually got me some performance enhancements after I did overclock it. Um, I've been getting the highest quadrant numbers on this. Even though the numbers aren't everything, but then it is, you know what I'm saying? Because it still gives you a feel of how fast it is. Because if you get like, you know, 9,000 on here, it's, you know, you, and you don't get it on an other phone, it's, it means my phone's faster, goddammit. <laughs> anyway, um, let's see what the scores over here will be uh, 59.39 now if you run it for a couple more times but but really check out the CPU number here 50, almost 16,000 um, that's very hard to do on older Android devices anyway very good ROM uh, I love it um, this is one of another you know developing ROMs right now you might want to check out if you're really into performance Fox Sound is the way to go and uh, you know Overclocking, for those of you new to overclocking in phones, it doesn't mean it's going to run at 1.704. Um, it's only going to ramp up as your phone needs it. Um, so if you're not doing anything, you have your turn phone turned off, it's probably running at like 300 megahertz. Um, but if you're, you know, if you're playing like HD games, it's definitely going to go up to 1.704. And you can always lower it, uh, and there's no... Um, I've I've been overclocking phones since like for almost two three years and um, I've had zero problems. The worst that will happen is that your phone will reboot and then you can set it a little bit lower, um, you know, and run apps. But um, it should run fine and uh, that's actually the widget there. It's kind of cool. I just want to show you that. Anyway, um, that was just a short overview. I just want to give you, um, you know. It's a very good ROM. Check it out, and also gives you DSP Manager and uh, performance enhan enhancements. Um, so you stay high on Android all the time, all through the weekend, you know. 
And uh, uh, if you have a Galaxy S3, don't forget to sign up for my email list at uh, galaxyS3root.com. We update you once a week with ROM of the Week, and uh, it's a great way for you to get in contact with me if you have trouble with your phone. And also, this is a nice case. I'll have links where you can get it. Um, I know people are going to ask. And also, uh, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button here, um, subscribe button up here, and use that share button to share this with your friends on Twitter, Facebook, or Google+. Um, and uh, stay high on Android, folks. And uh, as always, don't buy an iPhone. It sucks.